term we're evaluating from the left hand side, what is a number that's really, really close to negative 4, but from the left? So let's look at the number line system, guys. Here's 0, here's negative 4, that would be negative 3, this would be negative 5. Right? So from the real number system, going into um, getting really, really close to it from the left, what would be a really, really close number? Let's do 4.001. Okay? So let's do limit as x approaches negative 4 from the left. Let's plug in negative 4.001 plus 1 over negative 4.001 plus 4. Now, you guys would agree with me that that number is really, really close to negative 4 from the left hand side, right? It's really, really close to it. It's not, it's not negative 4. So it's not, the nice thing about this is it doesn't make it undefined. That's the cool thing, right? So what that gives us is when you, you know, combine these now, you're left with a, so here you're going to get a negative 3.001. Over, over here you're going to get a negative 0.001. Okay? Now, I'm going to tell you guys, we don't really care actually what the number is because you could have arbitrarily picked any number. Okay? So actually, I don't even care what those values are. And from now on, I don't even want you guys to use mental power in evaluating those numbers. All I want you guys to think of is positive and negative. Just think positive and negative. So if you add negative 4.001 plus 4, are you going to get a positive or a negative number? Negative. negative. Over here, negative 4.001 plus 1, are you going to get a positive or a negative number? Negative. Negative divided by negative is positive. Guess where it's going to go? Positive infinity. Okay, Because we know there's an asymptote there, right? It, we know there's an asymptote at 4. So we know it's not approaching a number, right?